Hello, this is Matthew Hatchett, your Minnesota Vikings correspondent for SchoolOfTheLegends.com, here with your Week 2 wrap-up. Well, Vikings fans, we're about this close to getting a win. Uh, being up 17 nothing at halftime gave us high hopes, but of course we couldn't finish and end up losing to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers 24-17. Bill Musgrave and Donovan McNabb must get on the same page, even though Donovan had over 200 yards passing, we need over 300 yards passing. This is the NFL. All these hitch routes to Percy Harvins and quick screens are really not adequate for the Vikings offense. They need to get Bernard Barron involved a little bit more downfield, and more importantly, get Vasante Shanko more involved down the middle of the field so you can try to open up some more space underneath for the Percy Harvins and the Michael Jenkins on the offense. Once again, Adrian Peterson was a beast, running over 400 yards and two touchdowns as well, but it, of course it wasn't enough to beat the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and end up losing 24-17. And the best part about the NFL, fantasy football. Of course, last week I was right, telling you to pick up Ryan Fitzpatrick. All of you that did, of course, he came out and balled for you. A couple more tips going into this week. I got two grown men that's going to be balling this week and getting it done. Number one, Thomas Jones. Of course, Kansas City Chiefs, they like to run the ball. And of course, with Jamal Charles getting hurt and he's out for the season, pick up Thomas Jones ASAP. And I'm sure he's going to have at least 20 carries and 100 yards this week. Number two on my pickup list is Nate Burleson for the Detroit Lions. Calvin Johnson's getting a lot of double teams, and of course he's being a red zone consideration because of his size, but from the 20s to 20s, Nate Burleson's getting all the catches and all the targets as well, as right now he's leading the Detroit Lions in catches. And on the downside for all you fantasy geniuses that think the North are talking about, Chris Johnson, sit him down. Javon Ringer getting the red zone carries, and he had a touchdown last week. And right now, Chris Johnson is just not in shape enough to carry the load in Tennessee. So there's my fantasy ups and downs for this week. That's our week two wrap-up here at Minnesota Vikings correspondent Matthew Hatchett here at SchoolTheLegends.com. You can also get at me at Twitter, at Hatch89.